Hey guys, what's up? So today I'm going to show you how you can fix the black screen problem in Epic Games Launchers. So uh, yesterday when I log off from my uh, account, my Epic Games Launcher is stuck on a black screen and it's not showing me a login screen. So there are different solutions on internet and I tried literally every solution and uh, nothing works for me. So at the end I just tried a different one which works for me and if you guys tried reinstalling rebooting uh, and re uh, installing in a different directory run it in a compatibility mode uh, dpi scaling or everything just skip to the end part of the video and i will show you the final solution which works for me only only the solution which works for me okay so and if you tried nothing you can just stick to this video and i will show you all the solutions which are on internet currently so the first solution they will give is run the epic games launcher in compatibility mode you can run it in a compatibility mode just right click the epic games launcher go in a properties go in a compatibility and just take this box okay and you can also try to to tw uh, tweak some settings here just change high dpi setting and try to tweak these settings it works for some people as uh, some people commented that they uh, uh, the solutions are working for them in some videos comment sections so yeah just try this solution and if it's not working for you just uh, chill we have more solutions so the second solution is uh, go in a display setting and change the scale and layout just try to change these settings and try to run it the th third solution is your uh, firewall might blocking the internet connection of your app to the internet so just go and search for firewall click and allow app allow an app through the firewall click on this just try to search epic games launcher okay let me do full screen okay here is epic games launcher as you guys can see uh, one two and everything is checked actually generally so you can change this setting by just change setting and tick boxes that's how you can change it so i already did it and it's not working for me as well the fourth thing is uh, many people suggest changing internet connections so many people don't have so many internet connections but i have three internet connection and i try to switch every internet connection it's generally not a solution okay so it's not work for me actually the first solution is change the dns the dns you can change it by just uh, click on this arrow or your this um, lan and then go in uh, network and sharing center go in ethernet properties and click on this internet protocol version 4 double click and then just use following dns just try to switch to google dns this is the google dns okay close okay this also not work for me then the final solution is you can just download a vpn uh, I'll give, show you a free VPN. Just go in a Windows Play Store, search for Touch VPN, and only this method works for me. And I hope uh, you uh, this method works for you also, guys. Oh, sorry, I uh, spell it wrong. I guess. Okay, this is the Touch VPN. Just click on it and download it and launch it the screen is like this connect to a random automatic server as we can just use this for one time login as you log in for the uh, first time after this uh, your launcher will be uh, normal again so yeah just connect it and launch it i can't connect it right now because uh, my fortnite is downloading due to this black screen problem i need uh, to uninstall everything that's why just try this vpn method it works for me thanks for watching the video